so I'm just here, Jack Byrne, calling to the Ireland squad. Uh, beat Bowes for the first time in a long, long time for Shamrock Rovers. How are you feeling? It must, it's been a great week for you. Oh, yeah, it's been a great week. Uh, obviously topped off with, uh, with a great night. I think, you know, we were due and we've, we've actually played quite well against them. We just haven't got over the line and tonight is probably the worst we've played, but, you know, we've got over the line and uh, I think it was a game of two halves, so I like the win. I don't know if you could see, like, from watching the game, but playing in it was so windy, like, you know, and uh, the second half they had the momentum and they were putting the pressure on us and we, we just couldn't seem to really get out. But, uh, come here, we'll take it. It's a, it's a great win for the club. Yeah, yeah I, I know what you mean about the win because I was actually sitting a couple of feet behind your, your yeah. family and the balls were spraying over that way towards Sean Cavanagh when you were spraying the balls yeah. over that. So, you know what you're talking about in that regard but as you say it was a game of two halves so I do think maybe the substitutions helped as well yeah. I mean they kind of nullified the threat um, yeah. but just overall you know uh, your performance I didn't think you played as bad probably as you, as you think you did but um, just kind of going forward now you, you know the league has kind of opened up that little bit more now so what are your thoughts on that regard we're just trying to we're just trying to you know keep keep as close to Dundalk as we can and then uh, see where it takes us. Um, we're just trying to win every game and that's that's the way the way we look at it. You know, we can't really afford to, to make any more slip ups in the league and you know, especially we can't in the cup like, you know, so uh, we'd be looking to win every game and uh, you know, we always go into every game, you know, trying to win every game. So uh, we'll we'll just keep trying to do that and see where it takes us and hopefully we'll be uh, there or thereabouts come the end of the season. Yeah, and you still have like quality players like Neil Farouge and stuff like that to yeah. come back from. You just have added quality yeah. with the likes of Graham Burke and Danny Lafferty and so on. So it seems like you're really trying to get, yeah. I suppose, the end of the season to really push on and yeah, have well that I momentum. Think, I think that's what uh, we might have been missing at the start of the season. We didn't have a, a big squad and we went down to Dundalk. Obviously, with you know, the likes of James Forlong playing left back, he's only 16, great player, but you know, it's a tough game to go into. And, uh, I think yeah, you were down to, to the bare bones. Yeah, we, we were, yeah, especially with the sending offs against Bowers and stuff uh, the game before. So, you know, we think uh, we're, we're more equipped now to, to deal with them situations. And uh, I think we've played five games in 15 days. And I think it showed a little bit in the second half, you know. We think it's a, it's a crazy schedule, but we have, uh, we, have, um, we have more of a squad now to deal with it, like, you know. Yeah, well, it seems you seem to be flying in Shamrock Rovers now. Um, you're going to be training now with Ireland from this week onwards. Um, what are your thoughts going into the camp now? Having trained with them before, you know what you're kind of getting into, don't you? First of all, obviously, you know, very honoured uh, to get the call up. Um, you know, buzzing that that we've been called up, but um, I don't know. I'm not really thinking about. It. I'm just thinking about training on Monday and just trying to do well, and then training on Tuesday and try to do well, and then and, and see what happens. Um, not really thinking about anything else other than just Monday morning and just trying to go in and try and well and just give a good account of myself. Yeah, well you must be extremely proud because the first League of Ireland player and I don't know how long to make that final squad. It yeah. shows that you're really, you're, you're really, you just really seem to be enjoying your football at the moment. Yeah. It's really showing. Yeah, well, you know, it's uh, as you say, I, I don't think uh, many players from the league get called up, but I'm sure there's plenty of more players and, uh, that can get called up, and I'm, and I'm sure that there will be in the future. And uh, I'm sure like half of the squad has played, you know, in the League of Ireland, a lot of the a lot of the Irish squads. So, uh, you know, I'm, I'm obviously delighted that Mick has put trust in me to call me up. Um, you know, but we are playing at a good level, like you know, we're playing European games. You know, Apple on Limassol, um, SK Brand, and they're now mugs, like you know. So there is good games, and uh, you know, I'm just delighted that he's obviously seen enough to to, to pick me in the squad. Yeah, well, Jack, I said I wouldn't keep you uh, too long. You're there with your family and the winds start blowing there. So it seems quite cold. So, listen, Thanks. best of luck. Hopefully, we're sitting here in a couple of weeks and you've got your first cap ah, on. All right. Fingers crossed. Thanks, Jack.